are here at Wired Fest with Heath, and Heath, you have um, something special to tell me about today, right? Uh, I was in the United States Army. I was I lost my legs over in uh, Mosul, Iraq, in 2003. Oh, I am so sorry. That was the best of us. Thank you for giving your life force over there. We really all appreciate that, and it's a really heartfelt thing. I just want to take a moment to really appreciate you and what you went through, and the amazing story that you represent to all of us because in the face of what could seem impossible you've now made you're a great example of what is possible when someone puts their mind to it well thank you very much I appreciate that I really do so tell me a little bit about the prosthesis um, I am walking on Autobox C legs they're uh, microprocessor controlled hydraulic um, uh, prosthetic limbs the C leg offers its own security by using a built-in microprocessor that reads information from gate sensors and with the help of specialized software controls a hydraulic system that creates resistance to flexion for the sea light. Here's how it works in detail. Two sensors, one near the ankle and one at the knee joint, take continuous readings of the user's gait and environment. These readings are sampled 50 times a second by the microprocessor, which analyzes the data with unique software based on the walking patterns of thousands of individuals. Because each sea leg user is unique, the practitioner will use Autobox software designed specifically for the sea leg to set special resistance parameters. Our Bionic Link system takes advantage of Bluetooth technology so you can adjust the sea leg performance without the hassle of cables. This enables you to fine tune the knee to the user's unique needs. These parameters allow the sea leg to know where the user will be in the next moment and enable it to function proactively. And so how long have you had them? Uh, I, technically, I've had them since January of 2004, and I've been walking on them uh, with no canes, crutches, wheelchair, nothing for a little over a year now. How does that feel? Uh, it's uh, awesome, actually. Um, I've been able to do things that I'd, I had um, written off as I would never do again in my life. So. That, that's pretty incredible. One of the things I love about technology is when it really changes our life to the better and makes us, you know, believe in the possibility. So, what was your life like before? Um, I spent 90% of my day in a wheelchair um, before, uh, and and I had the sea legs. It was just it was just getting used to them and learning to use them. Um, but you know, I, I couldn't really carry my children. I couldn't help my wife carry things, um, and it's given me all that back. Uh, I, I used to have to use hand controls and rely a lot on my family uh, and others to help me out. And now I've been able to go back to driving uh, without hand controls, using my sea legs to drive, and being able to help my wife carry the groceries and carry the kids as well. I come out and I talk with Autobach when I can. I talk with uh, my prosthetics company that, that makes my prosthetic legs, uh, Hanger Prosthetics and Orthotics, when I can, uh, to tell others about what happened to me and, and how I've been able to rehab out of it. Um, I play golf. I'm trying to get on the United States Disabled Ski Team, so I, I participate a lot in sports, help with a nonprofit that uh, helps wounded veterans called the Wounded Warrior Project, and just stay busy. That's excellent. So you've really turned your life completely completely around and that's really amazing because I, I know what that takes internally to do that because even if there's that opportunity there we might not even reach out and, and grasp it. We might say oh that's not for me or I can't do that and so that takes quite a bit of amazing internal strength. Uh, you hit the nail on the head. I've just, I've just been in a lot of uh, situations where I had great opportunities to participate in things. So, All right well thank you very much Heath. We really appreciate you and what you did for our country and what a great example you are. Well, thank you very much. I appreciate it. Thanks for coming out and talking to us today. This is our pleasure. Thank you.